Mark, so we've had a busy week again. So how have the preparations gone this week? I think as, as well as they could do. We've had two tough away travel. So um, it's, it's about getting that, that rest now into the boys. Um, ice baths, recovery protocols, uh, asking the boys to be as professional as they can away from the football club. Uh, and then getting as much work as we can do on, on the pitch. You know, it's a quick turnaround. Uh, you know, three game weeks are always, always difficult. But um, like I said, we can certainly be buoyed by uh, midweek, you know, getting three points on board will hopefully give us a good platform, uh, give us a bit of confidence. Um, so we're, we're very much looking forward to Saturday now. And it was a big effort from the lads on Tuesday. And, 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 you know, a few of them were just coming back into the squad from niggles over pre-season. So how are they coping? Is there any, any knocks or anything from Tuesday? No, I think everyone's recovered, recovered well, which is, which is great. And it, it was a mammoth effort and uh, the boys really dug deep. And like what you alluded to there, a lot of the players weren't probably quite ready for the minutes that they'd done last week. And um, they, they, they've come through them really, really well. So, uh, yeah, we're in, a, we're in a much better place now after, you know, two good performances, I think. We've shown different characteristics in all of our games so far. And like I said, certainly given us a platform to build on. We've certainly got some more minutes into players, so the group's getting more competitive. We've got Francis Amati back from suspension as well, so another player joining the group to give us more energy, more enthusiasm as well. And I'm sure the fans are excited to see him. So, um, yeah, we've got a big, big challenge ahead of us in Bromley. And then, again, another big, big club in the, in the division. Uh, had a great season last season, running a, a big race for the playoffs and, and winning at Wembley against uh, Wrexham in the trophy. So another big challenge awaits us, but one we're looking to meet head on. And as you say, um, Francis and Marty back in the squad and ready to go. We've, we've seen Justin and Ryan score their first goals on Tuesday. Also, Harry, Harry Panayuto had a really good game. And Tommy Willard as well. We know what he can bring. So it is, is that a selection headache ahead of this weekend? Um, I think yeah, That's what you want as a manager. I think all, all attacking players with great intent. Um, and that's what we want to do. I said we, you know, we wanted to address the balance in the squad. I feel that we've done that. I think we've got more front runners. I think we've got more attacking players with flair who can hopefully excite and dazzle and um, you know, get opportunities for, for goals and assists. And we can keep the energy high at the front end of the pitch. So that was always certainly the case. It's nice to have them all to be able to call upon now. And I think you've seen in the first three games, everyone's almost had a start now. So we're, we're building people's minutes. We're hopefully gelling as a group. And there's certainly hopefully more to come from them. And we saw as well two different tactical styles, two different formations in either half. So is, is, is that giving you a bit of a headache as well on how to play? No, I think we've looked at them all in pre-season. We sort of got enforced a little bit at the end of pre-season into, into one system, but one system that we've liked and used. And it's important in this, this, this league, especially with ourselves, with a smaller group, that we have to be adaptable. We have to be able to flip in and out formations. But the four formations doesn't concern me. It's our principles in there, the way that we attack the game, um, what we're like in and out of possession. I think nothing should change too much between in the, the formation. Yes, there's going to be tactical tweaks, but the mentality, the attitude, the desire has to be the same in, in, in all of them. Um, you know, we're trying to develop a way of playing here. We're trying to be exciting and on the front foot. But like I said we, we come up against a lot of different challenges and we've got to be able to adapt to them. Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.